saw a leprechaun yesterday. Were you wearing green? No. I think he was out to get you, but he won't stop us from getting into the news. The Literary Magazine is holding a celebration this Monday, March 21st at 6.30. If you are interested, come down to Nickel Play Arts. The Millers are bringing back dodgeball this March. It is $20 to form a team of five and to watch is $2. All proceeds will go to Riley Children's Hospital. If you would like to participate or just watch, contact Miss Muller in room 2248 or Miss Soderlin in room 2203. Let's see what Netflix will be charging us for this time in Trending Today. Our beloved Netflix will soon be launching a test which makes primary account holders pay an additional fee for users outside of their household. According to the Netflix Terms of Service, a customer's account may not be shared with individuals beyond your household. After turning a blind eye for so long, the company is finally going to be nudging freeloaders into paying for their own accounts. Now, let's bring it back to meetings. The Black Student Use Union is hosting a Pajama Jam Party Saturday, April 16th from 6.30 to 9 p.m. Tickets will be $10. For more information, email Ms. Purifoy or Mrs. Mendez. The Noblesville Students for Life Club will be holding a meeting during AL on Wednesday, March 23rd. The meeting will be in the Junior Senior Cafe. Remember to pick up a pass from Mrs. Ellis prior to the meeting in room 1244. All right, let's toss it over to sports. Before the leprechaun comes and gets you for your yesterday's mistakes. <laughs> Good morning, NHS, and welcome back to Fine Arts Friday. We'd like to congratulate our orchestra for having a fine performance this past Wednesday, and if you want to go support them even more, they're having their ISMA preview next Tuesday. Another congratulations to the NHS Color Guard, who got second at their state prelims competition. They won their competition this weekend, so come check them out. Also, the Nobles of Indoor Percussion Ensemble has their state prelim competition this weekend, so check them out as well. And if you want to go support all of your winter groups, you can go to their winter showcase at Noblesville East Middle School next week on Wednesday. Now, let's pass it on to our guest artist, Gabby Burlsma. Hi, I'm Gabby Burlsma, and I'm a senior here at Noblesville, and I am in am in the all women's show choir, New Dimension. So I got into singing because my older sister was also a singer and my mom is also a singer and my grandparents are also singers. So it was kind of in the blood, which is cool I guess. So it felt like I didn't really have an option to audition for show choir. So yeah, I'm here now just because um, my favorite part is that this year I got to have a solo, which is really cool. I never imagined that I would get a solo in New Dimension. I am going to Ball State for communications, and I would love to just work with the Disney company. I would love to do the Disney College program, and hopefully just spend the rest of my life down there. So. Wow, she was magnificent. Yep, and that's all we have for this week, Rylan. Peace out, NHS. <laughs> Tell us the truth. Tell us the truth. Tell us it. What do you have to say? What happened? 42. Oh. No! I knew it. <laughs> oh. oh, um, I think I'm gonna have a perfect bracket this year, Nolan. Me too. I'm I'm deciding the winner based off like their mascots. That's how you're supposed to do it, right? I'm sure that will work for you, but let's just go into head in the sports right now. Wednesday night, our varsity boys lacrosse team fell to Garen Catholic 14-2. The JV, bo the JV boys was a close 4-5 to five game. You can catch them Saturday the 19th against St. Joseph in South Bend. Tuesday night, our girls lacrosse team won their first game against Heritage Christian 15-13. You can catch them on Saturday the 19th at Beaver vs. Penn. The girls track team won the Hoosier Co Crossroads Conference last Friday at DePaul with an overall score of 102. Great job, ladies. Their next meet is on Saturday at Pike High School. The NHS junior Asher, Asher Propes has, been, has broke the school record for the 3,200 meter run. Propes ran a 925 two mile effort. His first mile was 450 following that 
his last mile, he finished it off with a blazing four minutes and 35 seconds. Congrats to Asher for taking first at the HCC Conference Indoor Track Championship. Now, on to pro sports. The Boston Celtics took on the Golden State, defeating them 110-88. to Jason Tatum led the Celtics to victory with a score of 26 points. You can catch the next round of games tonight at 7.30. Now, back over to meetings with Nolan. Any girls interested in trying out for volleyball should attend the call-up meeting on March 21st in room 1221 during AO. Come and get a pass from Fra Carrier if you plan on attending. Well, I will be sure to watch the games this week. I'm not really sure about Nolan, though. Well, I'll be watching the mascots, but you can check them out at millermedianow.org for more information. Peace out, Millers. Thank you.